My name is Leland Stillman. I'm a local general internist who specializes in integrative and natural medicine. For those of you from Tampa, Tampa area, hello. I'm new to the area. We're taking new patients, for the record. Um, so my friend Renita Brandon, I met through some really wonderful like-minded people, and she kept bugging me about this. And she kept telling me that I had to check this out, and so I did, and I started recommending it to my email list and my patients, and then the reviews started rolling in. And people were happy, people were getting results that I couldn't get with supplements and diet and lifestyle changes in a lot of cases, and people kept signing up and keep, kept renewing. So that's how I got here. Uh, Dr. Stillman, I've listened to some of your uh, podcasts, so I'm, uh, I'm pretty up on some of the stuff you got, and I'm really uh, excited about the peptides. Now, we talked about the copper peptides, can you kind of jump in and, and, and talk a little bit about peptides? Tell them a little bit what's going on here and what you see with what we have to offer with the X39. Yes, so for those of you who don't know, peptides are really how this whole product works. Now peptides can be anything from a few amino acids long, amino acids are the building blocks of protein, up to hundreds or over 100 sequences or amino acids long. When you start changing what peptides are doing, the way I look at peptides and proteins and enzymes is they're basically like the tools the body uses to get things done. And what you're seeing when you're using these patches is the, is the manifestation of these proteins doing the work inside the body. And part of what finally, because I have a similar story to him, I was very skeptical. Renita would not stop blowing my phone up and I'm grateful that she did. So with peptides, um, the way that these peptides work at least, the, you know, particularly the X39 and the X49, is they take free copper in your body and in your, t in your body's tissues and in your bloodstream, and they put it to work doing what it's supposed to be doing in the GHK and AHK uh, peptides. That's what you get the wound healing from, that's what you get the regeneration from, that's where you're seeing people's neurological issues go away. That was the thing that won me over, was particularly seeing people with the neurological issues give me testimonials and say, this has been amazing for my MS flares, this has been amazing for my foot pain and nothing else has helped, et cetera, et cetera. The thing that I want you all to know about peptides is that peptides can also be injected. Now, why do they have to be injected? Because your stomach has got stomach acid and enzymes that break down proteins, amino acids, and peptides. That's why you can't eat GHK peptide or AHK peptide and get the therapeutic effects that you would get with the LifeWave patches, right? Otherwise, you'd put this in a pill, wouldn't we? Because people are ready to buy a pill. They're used to that. They're like a little bit more skeptical of patches. The thing is, if you're going to bypass the stomach, you have to put it through the skin. So what do you do? You draw it up with a needle. The most common peptide that all of you have heard of is actually called insulin. It was the first peptide used therapeutically in the world. Of course, it's a life-saving medication. But now we're using more and more and more peptides. The world of anti-aging, regenerative medicine is just exploding with these peptides. Whole books are being written about them, more and more being characterized, more and more being synthesized. People are importing these from other countries. Compounding pharmacies are using them. People are getting great results, but here's the thing. 80% of the public doesn't want to inject themselves or have their family inject them with anything. They just want to live their life and be left alone. The beauty of the LifeWave patches is that they provide the benefit of peptides without requiring the needles. And that was why I started to, to use them. The other reason why, and that's so important, is that I want you all to know that much of the disease that you're seeing today is related to minerals being dysregulated in the body. And I started to use minerals in my practice some years ago and was really shocked by the results. And that's why when I heard, oh, this is basically a platform that allows me to put minerals to work in the body, well, no wonder it's getting me great results. Copper in particular is really important because when copper gets free and is not bound to the proteins that it's supposed to be using or used by, uh, it will create a lot of free radical damage and a lot of inflammation. And so the minute I saw, okay, people's symptoms are getting better or going away, and then they're actually regenerating, well, this makes sense. We're taking away the source of the damage and we're actually putting it to good use. 